ladies, welcome to 3 O'Clock Coffee, your daily pick-me-up from God's Word. Whether you're at home changing diapers or you're at work feeling like your boss needs them, let's get a dose to encourage ourselves, stay on course, and finish out our day strong. Let's take a drink. Are you ready? You know, one time I was going through a rough spot. I knew I was in God's will. I was in the right place at the right time, but something was just not working right. And the Lord showed me an image from a movie. Have you ever seen it when they're in the train station and the one person standing on the step holding the side and the lover is waving goodbye and they go off into the sunset? Well, the Lord showed it to me like this. I was standing there on the steps on the train, but as it left the station, I never got on the train and sat down in my seat. So even though I was going to get to the right destination, I was getting beaten up the whole way there. He said, Larissa, get on the train and sit in your seat. Well, you know, sometimes we're afraid. We're afraid to fully commit to the plan of God. In Ephesians 3.20, it says, Now to him who is able to do exceedingly abundantly above all that we ask or think, according to the power that works in us, to him be glory in the church by Christ Jesus to all generations forever and ever. Amen. You know, I was going to get to the right destination, but I might have gotten beaten up before I got there. You know, the Lord has a place for you. It's called the body of Christ. There's a local church for you. There's a place for you to serve for you and to exist and to flourish. And you need to get off of the step, get into the train, and sit in your seat. And when you sit in your seat, you can rest on the journey of getting to the place that the Lord's leading you, not get beat up the whole time. So let's get aboard the faith train. How about this? All aboard the faith train. Choo choo. Get in your seat and reach your destiny. Amen. Whatever you're going through today, know that God's for you and you can do all things through Christ who strengthens you.